All you want is my hunger All you need is my pain Nothing in between ever meant you lost When you were born it was On a cold November night I met my missus right is right. My feelings come to life absolutely unbelievable it's absolutely unbelievable my darling but kesoga soga it is what it is all right i'm going to speak with fumination so i'll speak to you later my darling all of my love hello my darling fumination <laughs> how are you how are we <laughs> My name is Fumi Desaluvold. For those of you that are stopping by for the very first time, you are so very welcome indeed. I brought my water, my darlings. Yes, I'm thirsty. Mm. How are you, my darling Fumi Nation? This, my darlings, are we living and loving, my darlings? The dress is by DVF, Diane von Furstenberg, in collaboration with Target. My wonderful, gorgeous husband, Ula, bought it for me. Can you believe such a fabulous surprise? And we have all kinds of pieces coming for the collection. He knows how much I love DVF. I've been wearing DVF ever since my mother gave me her DVF. As a matter of fact, I have a couple of DVF dresses right here. Let me just show you because I have like another rack here which I use on the daily or weekly of what kind of outfits I want to wear for you guys. Yes, yes, yes. So these are all DVF dresses. I have about 20 of them and I have some at the dry cleaners. Well, while I'm standing up, I guess I should show you. And so Ula bought me six more dresses. Let me know if you want to have a review because I can easily do that. I love, I love, 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 love these dresses because it just fits in with that hourglass. If you have hips, if you have a waist, if you have a bust like me, this dress is what you call what copacetic. Let me turn the back so that you can see what we are looking at. Boom, boom, boom. <laughs> are we living and loving, darlings? Are we living and loving? I love I love, 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 love wrap dresses. Love them. Super comfortable. You can wear it to work. I think they were celebrating 50 years of the wrap dress. And then the heels are Manolo Blanik. Do you remember the days of Carrie, Sex and the City? That's when I got these. So they're pretty, pretty old, but I keep my stuff. You know, I stuff them, I wrap them. So that's what we are working with today. The fragrance of the day is MS and this was a present from Ula and I love I love I love this fragrance the necklace is by Tiffany Amber Tiffany Amber is a Nigerian designer she does all kinds of fabulous things tell her that I sent you yes 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 I intend to get another necklace they come in a variety of colors and I absolutely love them and then the earrings are by H&M I just matched it up and that was that darlings we're having a meet and greet on the 21st of april i cannot wait to see all of you i cannot wait to buy your tickets it's pinned in the comment section it is also pinned underneath this video it is also on my instagram page you cannot miss it at all it's right there it's pinned for you to get tickets we're hitting capacity we're hitting capacity we're hitting capacity once we hit capacity my darlings that is what that is it you are going to be spoiled you're going to be adored there's music there's dancing we're going to take pictures together there's q a we also have wonderful doctors that and we're talking about fertility wellness health we're talking about menopause all kinds of questions about going forward in this world healthy living your life to the absolute max 
of which I intend to do. We also have Juvia's Place, of whom I've collabed with twice. They are the best when it comes to makeup for women of color. Because for women of color, it's always challenging to get our pieces. Juvia's Place is right out there. We also have Healthy Hair Studio, who has grown my crown back. And I am forever grateful. I'm sharing her with you. And there's a little surprise. A little surprise. You're going to live for it. We're getting sponsors literally every day. Wardrobe of Beauty. Brows. Oh my God. She did my brows and she got rid of over a hundred skin tags on my neck and on my face. Girl. Oh my God. You don't even know. We also have Willing Health Colonic Hydrotherapy. Cleansed. Detoxed, my darlings. Detoxed. Fabulous tarot collection with her jewelry. I'll be wearing her jewelry and her earrings she's going to make for me on the day. She made the necklaces of Adrian and Ula for me, of which I wear constantly. You're going to have that in the goodie bags. You have Lola Cosmetics, the best sexy blusher ever. She said, girl, I'm going to come on through. We have never knowingly boring. Just look at this, my darlings. And she's going to be there on the day with all of her fabulous hats of which, my darlings, you can take home. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. We also have non-profit organization and they stand for women that have left very challenging relationships and we're going to have chocolates with them. Darlings, the food, the food is going to be delicious, laid out for you, my darlings. Some of you said for me, should we dress up, dress up to the nines. Thank you, my brothers. Thank you, my brothers. Thank you, my uncles. I love you. They're buying tickets for those that cannot afford tickets. I've already given out 20. And I was like, oh my God. Thank you, my beautiful, beautiful brothers. I am so, 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 so grateful indeed. Darlings, at the Novotel Hotel on the 21st of April, we are going to have an epic, an epic moment together. And then it's going to be New York. New York you are bigger we're looking at venues once we got venues i will let you know for the fitness my darling some of you are telling me that you cannot see the join button a lot of you from jamaica i don't know why i'm going to speak to my youtube partner this week and find out exactly what is going on but for those of you that want to join it is right there you join and then when you join you will see live fitness with fumi we are on monday through friday but if you want me to switch it up for the week Weekends. your wish my darling is my command yeah okay all right let us get to the issue at hand when I covered Drea Michelle and Janelle Green there were so many comments in the comment section saying men do this a lot and you are absolutely right we have the beautiful Akoi Lee Simmons who has swept social media with her latest update when it comes to relationships because she was seen kissing and enjoying herself with a 65 year old restauranter Vittorio Asaf she is 21 and he is 65 so there are four people I'm going to address because we already know the story they're, they're dating all of this so on and so forth they were in St. Bart's they were having a fabulous time together and everybody uh, as they should, is looking shocked. And I wanted, and that was why I came out here and said, I'm going to address this now, once and for all. I wanted to wait till next week, but I said, you know what, for me, address it now, once and for all. So I'm going to address um, Kimora, her mom. I'm going to address Akoi, Akoi Lee. I'm going to address Russell Simmons. And I'm going to address Vittorio. If you read psychology in uni or you're studying psychology as an elective course, for those have, that have ever studied psychology, drop it down in the comments. Psychology 101, 102, 103. That was what we did when we were in uni. I studied psychology as an, as an elective. I studied business administration, but I did. I say that because I was reading all of the stories on social media and they were talking about oh you know it's money it's this it's that da 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 i don't know is it just me 
it really and truly, is it just me? I felt that Akoi was talking straight to her father. That she was letting her father know what she was doing. She wasn't talking to anybody. She wasn't trying to... I don't even think it's the money. I think that Akoi did this to get her father's attention. And that's where the psychosis comes from. For me, humbly. I feel that the first man that you do love is your father. Your father is your world. He's big, he's tall, he's strong. He's the first man you love. You even have young girls that say, when I grow up, daddy, I will marry you. It's their fathers that they love. I think the breakdown of the marriage of himself and Kimora affected Akoi. She's a university graduate that graduated from Harvard. Well done, Kimora. But being a university graduate, being an academic, does not mean that you understand the ways of life. Life is another study, and it takes time. On top of which, she's only 21. The breakdown of that marriage, terribly for that matter, has affected Akoi. And as they grow up, our children do, you see how certain things affect them. The older sister, Ming, seems to be very quiet. You don't see or hear, nor does she respond. She doesn't complain, she doesn't explain. Akoi is a different personality, end of, just a different personality. Equally beautiful, wonderful, intelligent. But she's naive, she's a young child. And I think that she is missing her father. The way her father cut them off financially. For them, it's not the financial. It's the lack there of love. You see, when a couple divorces, the children always say, but daddy knew I was here. But daddy knew I was here and daddy left me. They don't understand the dynamic. Children are very straightforward. They love you completely. They love you wholly. They don't understand about money and stuff like that. All they think in their head is that mommy and daddy didn't get along. Okay, but I didn't do anything. Why did daddy leave me? Why didn't daddy come back? Because of how much and how deep their unconditional love is for them. We can say anything about Russell. We really can, Simmons. Their children, his children, Ming and Ayoki, will love him as their dad. Regardless of Akoi jumping onto Kimora's side, they still love their dad. It's their dad. Their dad is part of their identity. Former Commissioner for Health Legal State, Dr. A.A. A. Desalu. That's my father. My name is his. That's where I get my confidence. Are you asking? That's where I get my confidence. I know who I am on the inside. That's why you can't affect me on the outside. I know who I am. My parents have been married for 57 years. It's the foundation you set of which your children will sprout. And if you set the foundation really, really solid, you can even co-parent and the children are able to still get a chance of self-confidence and self-love. For whatever reason, I just saw Akoi directing all of this to her father, my boyfriend, my this, my that, because she knew that it would get to him, because she knew that it would burn him, because she knew that as careless as he has been with relationships or even that he dated the mother early, that this would burn him. Because those that know, know how it affects. 
because we see it all in the papers. We see all of it in the papers. And children are very different because Ming might be feeling it too, but it might come out of her differently. It might come out later, also maybe in relationships, because their father was absent, because their father treated their mother in a certain way, because their father treated them in a certain way. And if you notice, a lot of children, they're so easy to forgive. Daddy, it's okay, we forgive you, you're here, we forget it. Because these children go to school, and these children go to universities, and these children go to parties and events, and they've got everything. They've got everything, the money, the Beverly Hills, the this, the that, but the love. And they see their friends with their fathers, with their moms, they see them at Thanksgiving, and it's not the same in their house. This is love. Dating Vittorio, she's looking for, she's looking in him what her father did not give to her. He gave her everything. The money, the prestige. She's modeling, you know, because Kimora was a model, so Kimora can open those doors. Absolutely. You can give them everything. But if you don't give them love, and a sense of self and respect and a safe space where they can trip up and you are there to say, come on, get up, get up, get up. It affects them further down in life. There's no reason for a koi to date this older man. No reason whatsoever other than the way Russell has treated herself and her sister and her mom. And she's going right back to square one and said, you know what, I'm going to do this. That was how I saw it. Akoi, leave this man. Leave modeling for a year and go into therapy. You need to find your own path and you need to heal. You're hurting very, 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 very badly. And it's not your fault. It's not your fault. But don't make a situation even worse. It was very difficult for me to listen to what you were saying because you're a 21 year old child and it was so childish it was so childish and the point that you're trying to make across to social media is unfortunate because social media is not looking at you like that and I know that perhaps you didn't see it that way get off social media get off modeling for a year and go into therapy do some art do some painting but go into therapy and talk about everything that has been hurting you without your mom, without your dad, because you need to heal and you need to find your own path. Hey, in St. Bart's, um, I'm so sad, but I'm very sad, very happy. And when I return home, um, everybody who knows me will be getting a happier, more chilled out version of me. <laughs> My boyfriend is checking in. I don't know why we're checking in in advance like this. Probably because I always miss flights. I should just show. Crepe? Huh? Crepe? No. Yes, no crepe? Oh, I thought you were saying no. No, I can't. I couldn't check in because I don't have my link on. I'm making my final safe bars video. Aww. Would you like to share your favorite thing about the trip anonymously? <laughs> you. You said me. Do we do? Do you want me to open the drink? Baby, you are on. Shush. Huh? Shush. I'm making this video. Baby, do you want to go to Kenya? Kenya? Someone has invited us to Kenya. Uh, you know, Kenya is not Whoa. Be dangerous, but... Shut up. Never mind. Shush. When are we going to Japan? Actually. Japan is so much better. Baby, shush. I'm going to stop. I am though a big Bulgari person. 
I am, though, a big Bulgari person. I got the message. Okay, I just want to make that very clear. Bulgari. Wee. Oui. Bye, Bulgari. Hopefully they have my necklace when I come back. Hopefully. And they don't sell it to somebody else. I'm sure they have another 17 on their counter. Oh my god, look at this giraffe. We're obsessed with this giraffe. This is our favorite giraffe. No, I want my crepe. I know, but you can walk there and then eat it there. So we get an hour. <laughs> no, okay. it's okay. Get into the giraffe. Okay. I, you can only see his neck. I know, but it's coming now. now Ooh, you know what I also like a lot? Yeah. Which one? The rest? Cartier. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. Baby, when you were uh, either asleep or at Celine, me as one of my followers saved a bird. You saved a bird, huh? Yes, it was dying. Yeah, I know, I do. I want, I want a crepe. No, I know, but I just asked you what I want. Oh no, we can walk together. Baby, jump out and start to order to crepe. Okay, what do you want? For me, a normal crepe. Jump, jump no, here. No, matter, come close. I have to find some No, matter, come Nutella. No, no, regular. What's, what's regular? Normal crepe. What's normal crepe? Sugar and butter? Yes, yeah, yes. Yeah, Baby, <laughs> what flavor? What flavor? Hopefully one day you'll be a wonderful mom, you'll be a wonderful wife, and you can decide how you want to raise your children. Parents are not perfect. There's not a book that they get when you are born to say this is what we should do, what not do. I am a parent and I am not perfect. I work at it every single day. I try to be the best mom. But that's all that I can do. But I'm not perfect. Nobody's perfect. Your parents are not perfect. This older man is not the way to go. You should not be dating this man. He's too old for you. And it's disrespectful because of my African roots to be telling him to shut up and to shush. It's just so disrespectful. It was, it was grinding my ears. I had to stop. You don't look bright on social media and you went to Harvard if you know what I mean I'm talking to you like an auntie so no judgment it's a safe space it's not a big deal it's not a big deal you know it's an experience hey you were in St. Bart's you had fun Vittorio you should be terribly ashamed of yourself darling you should be and um, this is to Russell in particular Russell do you see how you are being disrespected. That Vittorio does not even fear or is not even afraid to date your daughter. Vittorio would never dare date Obama's daughter. He wouldn't try it. He wouldn't what? He wouldn't try it. He has too much respect or he would be too afraid to do it because he knows Obama is in the back. Because of the way you are, Russell, and the way you have presented yourself, Vittorio can now mess around with your daughter. Vittorio, you will get it back in droves. You're a 65-year-old man. You're supposed to protect, guide, and even give Akoi a job at the restaurant and show her how to make food and how to build her own brand. If there's any contact that you should be having, that is what you should be having. Where it was irritating to my ears how she was disrespecting you, it gave me so much joy that she did disrespect you because you disrespect yourself. You have no sense of self. It's very disgraceful. What is wrong with you? Find somebody in their 50s and go and enjoy the sunshine. You're a 65-year-old man that has children. You don't want that to happen to them. So why are you doing it with this young lady of which we both know you're having a good time with? It's disgraceful behavior. I will say it out anywhere. More so you because you've lived your life. More so you because you know what you're doing. More so you because it's calculated in every way, shape and form. It's disgraceful. 
uh, Kimora, bless your heart. You have to go and get a koi. You have to go and get your daughter. This is when being mommy is hard. This is when being mommy is tough. You have to go and get your daughter. Because you know, Russell is out there in Bali. He's dodging, you know, all kinds of summons. You have to go and do the hard work. Get somebody to stay at home, look after the children, and drag baby girl back home. And you sit down with her and you tell her, Sunshine, we're not having that. Kimora, the two of you go into therapy. Bring Ming Li as well. All of you need to talk and all of you need to air out things that are on your heart and in your mind. Russell, do you see what happens? I could easily sit here and say karma for all that you've done. Look at what is happening. And maybe in a way, it is. Your children need you. When are you going to come home and take responsibility for everything? Family is everything. Think about it, Russell. Think about when you want to go home. When do you want to go home and sort out your family? Or does it not mean anything to you anymore? Because your daughter needs you. Ladies, gentlemen, Fumination men, I live for you. I'm getting used to it now. Do not forget to like, to subscribe, hit the notification button, my darlings, and I will see you what? I'll see you sooner than later. And when the entire collection comes in, we'll have a fabulous review. And I hope one day FDV will collab with DVF. Wouldn't that be a trip? <laughs> All of my love. Mwah. <laughs>